Hey, welcome back to Plastic Madness. Uh, today we're going to be looking at another figure uh, from Saint Seiya, uh, from the uh, Hades uh, chapter. Um, this one is from, uh, this figure is from uh, Shine Time. Shine Time. Um, this one is uh, Akaren, uh, Karen, uh, the ore from uh, what, uh, Shine Time Cohen, the sticks, uh, Boatman uh, Karen. Um, this is the one that allows them to uh, cross the uh, Styx uh, river. Um, so not much in the box, just uh, the surprise or the sapuri uh, in its uh, object mode. Uh, big box, heavy. Um, so let me get everything uh, out of. Uh, let's get everything out of the box now. Like, so you can see what's, what's inside and how this the figure comes. Uh, so you get uh, two blisters and a few bags with um, faces and uh, hairstyles, the helmet and some hands. So that's what you get. So let me get everything out of the blisters and uh, we uh, we do uh, uh, we'll take a look at the parts all the parts we put them together and then do a 360 view with final thoughts all right all right and now we have uh, uh, Akron Karen out of the uh, blister and um, interesting enough we get some instructions uh, which those are always appreciated uh, this one is about the pin for the neck it says the neck connector is too tight please pull out the upper part and insert the the hair so and the other one is uh please install the belt first then install the uh, belly armor or the uh what i call it the up uh, cover so <clears throat> let's see first we get a a boat nicely painted um and that's it. it i guess we can we can use him for for display which is kind of cool it's kind of cool um uh, i think originally the that's part of the um uh, for the bandai one it's it has an option that you can see uh, you where well, you can be, you build the object around this uh or pretty much you pretty much you see the object on this uh this one does not have a seat or anything it's just hollow inside so and it's not big enough to fit uh, say uh, in Shun in there uh, but nevertheless uh, nice to have this uh, the boat uh, and the paint is very very nicely done nicely nice details all right <clears throat> let's stop talking about the boat uh, all right so you get four faces two face interesting enough that the first the two faces for him without the helmet um, they already have like a uh, the hair, the the four the front part of the hair uh, added to the face, uh, and the faces are very cartoonish. But that's that's his face. Uh, so I'm not gonna use them. I'm gonna use the ones with. Uh, I'm gonna display him with the helmet. Uh, so these are the faces that you get for the helmet. Uh, also, noticing it's like. It's like a, the piece, the mouthpiece, uh, it's like a, like not the mouthpiece, but the, the inside of the mouth is like a second part added, at least on this one, not, not on this one. Uh, so that's an interesting uh, choice, um, which I guess it adds more, more detail because you can paint it everything because everything's painting, painted nicely inside. So uh, I guess that's how you do it. So uh, then you get like uh, the back uh, part of the hair. Uh, nicely done uh, very very hard plastic uh, and you have the ponytail uh, I don't remember if you had to use the ponytail uh, when you build without the with a helmet but I'll, I'll, I'll take a look and see you get the hands the, sorry the face covers two of them uh, then you get the hands you get two holding hands to hold the the ore. Or uh, 
two open hands, two grabbing hands, and two fists. So that's it. Uh, and the paint is not the best. Uh, it looks like a, um, they, they need to a new an extra coat of uh, paint for the fingers, uh, but no no big deal. All right, let's go to the the body. You get an uh, EX metal body um, in two tones. Uh, oh, it comes with the feet installed, so we gotta remove them. Uh, this hip is a little bit uh, soft here, so I'm not sure how's that gonna work. Uh, the rest of the joints, they're like nice and tight. Um, let's see, let's extend. Uh, I don't know if they, I can't remember if the shine time, oh yeah, they, they do extend. Okay, all metal inside. You can see. Uh, let's see. Is the pin too? No, the pin is not too hard to remove, so we won't have to be following those instructions. Ah, uh, but good to know. <coughs> let's see. We got a helmet over here. Very nicely done. Uh, nice paint. Uh, that's where the plastic sprue. That's what connect to the to the plastic sprue. Is it one piece for the helmet? Yeah, it looks like it's just one piece. So. Um, the jester uh, outfit that he wears. Um, so it's disappointing. The two wings, which in theory they're supposed to be uh, the boat. Somehow the wings turn into the boat. Uh, would be something like this. Um, there. So these ones they connect via uh, a little ball peg. On the back of the, um, no, it's not a ball bag. It's like a like a flat uh, swivel there, and they move in and out. Uh, it has a front piece that has to be removed. Okay, notice that. Okay, so this is the the front piece for the chest, and this it opens this way. Very nicely done. There's some dust in there, but it's in, in the inside, so it's no big deal. Um, and I'm seeing that like this this armor has like a. I'm gonna skip to the shins, um, just because I just review some of the <coughs> the judges, uh, and except for Radamantis, uh, the other two have like very a lot of plastic on their on their shins. And this one is like the shins is like like a very intricate and nicely and super nice design. Uh, but they're all metal, nicely painted. Uh, I know that CS model copy exactly what Bandai did. So hmm, these are really nicely painted, <clears throat> nicely done. Uh, all right, let's go back to the shoulder pads. Dusty. No paint issues. This is the left one. This is the right one. No, no paint, no paint chips or anything bubbles. Okay, so so far this figure is looking really, really good. Um, the the ore is nicely done in two colors. You're flexible. Then you have the. Um, the belt with the the belt with the um, um, what do you call it <clears throat> uh, the skirts the skirt panels uh, we might have to remove some of them to install it I think maybe we'll see um, nice black plastic uh, belt clip so uh, kind of like blends with the whole thing uh it's stuck on one side but it's supposed to come out okay we'll do that in a minute um super nicely painted uh no issues there wow coming back coming from the reviewing the three the three judges this one is like a, a breath of fresh uh, fresh air 
again, different mark, different, different mark, different brand. So, uh, right. So, uh, app cover in two colors. Uh, one is like a purplish, and the other one is like a dark uh, silver, dark chrome. Nicely done. You got the knee pads. Uh, and um, arm covers, very nicely done. Uh, has some plastic on it. And um, bicep and uh, thigh covers. Super nicely painted, metal, no scratches. Wow, this, uh, I'm super excited for this one. All right, let me put them together and then we do a, a 360 view and then we do a final, final thoughts, all right? All right, and now we have uh, uh, Acura and Karen uh, uh, put together on the 360 view. And I gotta tell you, I'm so excited about this figure. Like, I'm so happy. Uh, everything looks good. Uh, there are no scratches on the paint. Uh, everything fits nice. Uh, maybe this this sheen, uh, needs a, uh, it falls a little bit, but so far, the second time that I push it up, it stayed the same place. Um, so let's go with the few things that I think that got not as good. Um, this, at least with this hand, I don't know. I haven't checked the other, the other, uh, uh, left hands. Um, the face cover keeps, is loose, fits loosely. So just be aware of that, uh, in case, uh, it falls, falls off. Um, what else? Uh, the sheen, the sheen cover, maybe. Uh, oh, and um, I think it might be an issue with my figure. Uh, this, uh, the left uh, hip uh, hip joint, it's a little bit loose. So right now I'm using like too sticky because this one is, it tends to open uh, more than it was supposed to and the base is kind of like slippery. So, um, and that's it. No more, no, no other, other issues. Uh, the positive like paint flawless no issues at all beautiful paint beautiful um the part the plastic pieces they fit super nicely also uh i think they use black plastic for the for the plastic pieces on at the at the cuffs because when i trim a little bit the excess material that it had it didn't show as white it shows like in black so that's that's a nice nice surprise because I thought was, oh maybe I'm gonna I gotta paint it so nope it's black uh, uh, so yeah uh, I don't know head sculpt like they're awesome the helmet it looks uh, great um, I think this is this is the be one of the best figures so far so it can be done they can make figures that. Repl uh, replicas or copies of fear and they can make them nicely uh i mean it he's slightly more expensive than the other ones was like 60 bucks but come on uh minos was <laughs> also expensive and he had a ton of issues so and it looks used this one looks new it looks new it is new and it looks new so thumbs out there like 
I gotta tell, like Shine Time is and with this figure, like outdid themselves. Um, and super possible, like, and still everything, all the joints except for the the leg, all the other joints are like tied nicely. These the wings, they they stay in place. Um, I don't know. I think this figure is great. This is like a if you can get it, if you were thinking of getting this figure, just go get, go ahead and buy it. Um, because this, it's, I, like, I'm so happy that, like, finally, after uh, so many, like, issues with those, all the past figures, this one is, like, great, like, so paint, the wings in the back, uh, it's, it's super well done. Again, thumbs up to uh, 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 Shine Time. So, yeah. Look at that. Let me zoom a little bit more. There we go. There we go. Look at that. So, so nice. Yeah, this is gonna be look so good on the on the shelf with other uh, uh, specters, and you can the boat. La la la, la. or oh, gondola maybe because he's he's Italian, so this should be like a little gondola. Yeah. Uh, all right. Well, I'm gonna finish the review here. Uh, I don't wanna make it too too long. So. Uh, this was the review for uh, Akira and Karen uh, or uh, the boatman from the Styx River from uh, Shine Time. Uh, it's a copy from the one from Andai. Uh, awesome figure. If you want to get it, definitely it's a recommended. Uh, highly recommended, I will say. <laughs> um, beautiful figure. Uh, so, um, got this one from AliExpress. Uh, Came in a super nice box. Comes in two blisters. Uh, you get the boat or the gondola. Uh, uh, faces for and without the uh, the helmet. Uh, and uh, if you like the video, give it a like, subscribe, uh, leave a comment if you had this figure and, and you had any issues or not. Uh, hopefully you didn't, because I mean, finally it's a figure that has like. The issues are mi super minor, um, and um, if anything, I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. If you didn't like it, give it a thumb down, also leave a comment, all those cool things you can do. Uh, and if anything, I hope you enjoyed the video, alright? Well, I'll see you in the next video, take care, and thanks for watching. Alright, bye.